Hey guys, it is Dr. Eric here. Let's look at another rate of change problem. This um, is more aligned to what you might see on the EOC. So it says that this table um, defines a quadratic function. What is the average rate of change between x equals negative 1 and x equals positive 1? So basically, it just wants to know what's the difference between this one here and this one here. So you have multiple ways that you can do this problem. First of all, you can just do my easy way, which is 5 minus negative 1 divided by negative 1 minus 1. I just do top minus bottom, top minus bottom. When you make sure you put in the y's first in the numerator, like from the slope formula, so I'm just going to hit the division symbol and type in 5 minus negative 1. Dr. Erig, I'm never supposed to have two negatives next to each other. In a calculator, you can. In real life, you can't. But in a calculator, the calculator is smart. It knows what to do when there's two negatives touching. In the denominator, negative 1 minus negative 1. There's my answer, negative 3. That's one way you could have done it. Another way that you could have done it is maybe you don't want to use the formula. So we're going to go to the graphing calculator instead. And we're going to do plus sign table. I know it's been a lot of videos since we did that. And we're going to type in our different problems. And really, I'm still going to type everything in, but you really only need to type in the first and the third one, like really. And this is why. Let me take. Let me actually take out these points here. Now we can look at it here, and it's the same way. I can count and be like, okay, well, I go down one, two, three, four, five, six. So I went down six, and then from there I went over one, two, over. 2. So down is negative 6, over is positive 2, and then hopefully in your head you know that, but if you don't, you can do negative 6 divided by 2 and get negative 3 that way. So either way, you can use the graphing calculator to help you. They're trying to trick you by having little extra points in, so only pay attention to the points that you actually need.